Let's go further here. Good to have you um, uh, in, uh, in Greece to discuss, uh, you know, very, very uh, interesting um, uh, topics. We've uh, worked uh, very hard over the past uh, five years uh, to sort of bridge this innovation gap, which we uh, inherited back in 2019. And uh, I do think that uh, we've made, uh, you know, significant steps uh, in, uh, in the right direction, you know, be it... Uh, you know, the digital transformation in terms of the uh, interface between the state and citizens and businesses. Our gov.gr uh, site has been truly transformational in that uh, uh, respect, uh, focusing on improving the quality uh, of our digital uh, infrastructure, creating what I think is a very vibrant ecosystem for startups uh, and new technology companies, which has to a certain extent also been able to bring back people from abroad because we have a very, very talented uh, pool of Greeks who left Greece uh, during the crisis. And of course, now the next step, we will be completing very soon uh, our AI strategy, uh, which will be submitted to me within the next uh, weeks because we also want to see how Greece can position itself uh, in this uh, sort of uh, emerging ecosystem of artificial intelligence, uh, where I think we also have uh, um, uh, something important to, to contribute. But uh, of course, uh, you know, your portfolio is, uh, is 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 very broad. We have uh, a new team in a new team in uh, you know in, in place uh, in in charge uh, of research and uh, innovation. And I'm very interested to hear your thoughts and how we can sort of further strengthen the cooperation between you know, between uh, the you know the Commission and, and Greece. Thank you. Thank you so much, uh, dear Prime Minister. First, let me say it's a great pleasure to be here today in such a sunny, beautiful day in beautiful Athens uh, for a wonderful occasion to launch two events, the Trusted Investor Network and also the scaling up of the European Innovation Council uh, Club. So these are two very important milestones in, in uh, fostering the European innovation ecosystem. As you mentioned yourself, this has become a top priority in our agenda for the next commission. As you know, competitiveness will be uh, the number one priority and what a better instrument to foster that through research and innovation. So I'm really happy to be here. I had a wonderful discussion this morning with uh, the colleagues just that are sitting just in front of us, with Deputy Minister, with a range of uh, investors, innovators, uh, Greek companies that benefited from the European Innovation Council and are exemplary in how we should tackle that innovation gap that you mentioned. Mm -hmm. So I'm looking forward, uh, just after our meeting, we will do the official uh, launch of, of uh, the two events. And I want to encourage really Greek companies, innovators, researchers to take active part of the programs that are available from the European Union because this is what they are for, mm -hmm. really to foster and to encourage this entrepreneurial innovator spirit that we want to retain and remain in Europe. Mm -hmm.